Леди и джентльмены, дамы и господа, вы смотрите канал Настоящая Россия. Boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen, you're watching Real Russia Channel, the deepest insight into the real Russian life with no fake and uh, no bullshit. Yes, you tell this to me. Well, that's Renat, Renat Kutlu Ahmedov. He is now behind the camera, also known as Ready, Ready Kittle. And my name is Sergey Baklikov. We are in the city of Ufa, the capital of the Republic of Bashkortostan of Russia. Ufa is the capital of the Republic of Bashkortostan of Russia. This is Kafkaska Street, and we came to one of the first co-working clubs in the city of Ufa, which is called the Time Office. Right next to a huge, tall residential building, there an old school wooden house. Look at this. You see? Yeah. So let's get inside. Co-working club. It works from 9 a.m. to 9 p.m. Let's get inside. Здравствуйте, здравствуйте. The reception and these beautiful ladies. Well, uh, here is the personal boxes where we can leave our personal uh, things. Well, let's leave our bag here, man. So, I can say that the prices here are very reasonable. The prices for a day here starts from five American dollars, or in rubles now it is 350 Russian rubles. You can pay as by cash, as through the Visa, Mastercard, in Russia also Maestra. I can see the microphone, actually the speakers, so we can announce that we came here. Let's try this. Hello everyone, boys and girls. This is the real Russian, the deepest insight into the real Russian life with no fake and no bullshit today here. Okay, thanks, thanks a lot. The machine where you can get a column, you know, here actually the people invest in the American economy. Well, the Russian juice, which is called Dobry, actually means kind, MM Dance, Mars, and that's it. Well, here is also the table games, including the games in English language, language so you can take it and go play. Uh, can I leave my jacket? Co-working club. Actually, this is a pretty interesting way of organizing the working space, the working atmosphere around you. Well, this is something average between the work at home and the work in the office. And uh, the main difference here is that if you're a small company, if you're a beginner, or if especially you're a freelancer, uh, you, you don't have enough of money or the m amount of money of, is critical for you and you can't let yourself to rent an office uh, then you j can just come into such a places and just starting from five dollars a day to work here and to have everything for your work well also this is uh, a great place for making the lectures master classes trainings a good place for uh, Community meetings, for example, here is uh, happens the meetings of the English club. And now let's get inside of each room. Well, come on. Hello. Hi. How are you feeling here? Fine, because I have the answer. You're a participant of uh, an English club, right? Kind Yes, great, great. So, and uh, sometimes you're coming here to work as well. Yes, exactly. Okay. Not so, sometimes, but every week. And yeah, almost good. every day. And so, what is your impression about this place? This place is awesome. Yeah, great. Really great. awesome. That was the first room. Next thing, the next room. Actually, that's how is the working places looks here. Well, you can take just five dollars and rent a place here to sit just everywhere where it's free and to work. Place your laptop and yes, you can bring your desktop here as well and to work. Of course, unlimited 
Wi-Fi with unlimited and high-speed internet is here available. Also available a printer so you can print out something and also there the kitchen, toilet and many things. The boxes so you can place somewhere under the table, something under the table. Well, I don't know, the lamp. This is the conference room with an ability to make a Skype conferences. Let's get inside. Well, it's really comfortable that, uh, you know, even if you will rent an office, just a separate office for yourself, it's not a fact that you will have a conference room, but here you will. So easily you can uh, meet here with your partners, with your colleagues, uh, make, uh, make meetings, and that's it. So everything what you need here, table, uh, Skype video camera uh, and the desk. Real Russia was here. Well, now actually we can see some of the freelancers, I don't, residents who came here to make their business here. Well, they are just sitting with their laptops and making their work. So, how are you feeling, guys? Uh, thank you. I think you better ask this guy. His English uh, very well compared to mine. So, how are you feeling working uh, in this uh, co-working club? Uh, yeah, all good. Um, coming here occasionally. So, I'm um, working as um, IT engineer. So, running a small business. Um, so partly from home, uh, partly from here, like on some days I'm coming, coming here. Are you a programmer or designer? Or, or? Uh, I'm a technical support engineer. Okay, got it. So I, I guess uh, this place is mostly uh, the best for uh, such a creative and technical professions like uh, uh, programmers, like uh, designers. Yeah, for IT people, for uh, really startups. startups. Okay, got it, got it. Thanks for the comments, for the comments. Well, also here I have to notice that uh, you can uh, juggle, juggle with the tables and actually to redesign it for uh, all kinds of the events. Let's say you can redesign it for lectures, for the master classes, for the movie club. You know, you can here also watch uh, different movies, so you can make something like a cinema hall, movie hall. Third room, third room. Well, hello. Uh, actually, here is also, we can see just the working places, so you can uh, take a seat here and to work. Let's look at the toilets. Uh, come on. This is the toilet, so here you can uh, make your things, so you can hear seat and fart and poop. Well, then wash your hands, well, dry this, look at yourself, make a hair and go. Well, and here is the kitchen, let's look at the kitchen. What's this? And Apple, I know that freelancers actually the fans of Apple, that's why Apple's here, probably. Well, sushi, ginger, wasabi. Well, it seems like it's pretty great menu today here. Well, pizza. Well, the stove, the microwave, oven. Yes. Panasonic, same as uh, the brand of our camera, Panasonic GH4. And the fridge. In Russian language, this is холодильник. Холодильник. What's here? Let's look at this. It's full of uh, sweets, cookies, I don't know, chocolate, ketchup. No vodka here. Really, not every Russian drink vodka. Amazing, amazing designers thing here. This is an idea of designer of Ruslan. Ruslan, you know, 
he uh, just got an idea to make this picture of the diver, actually to draw this diver here right near the anti-fire equipment, uh, balloon. Well, now let's go to the next places here. Here is also the offices, the room, but this is the room for more long-term clients. Let's get inside. Here is a lot of uh, wonderful ladies. Uh, всем привет! Простите, что побеспокоили, но хотим показать немножечко, uh, как все здесь выглядит. I think that the main difference between a short-term working places and long-term working places like this is that here they have a separate printer, they have an additional uh, furniture uh, where they can, can place different boxes, different papers, and that's it. So we can see this, you know? Well, pretty comfortable and nice office. Let's, let's get inside to the final part of this and we'll go to the balcony. Всем привет! That's it. So, uh, here is the same, you know? This is actually how is uh, the room with the places for uh, long-term uh, clients looks like. And the balcony. This place is pretty safe because right in front of the Time Office Club we can see the police department. The police department of Kirovsky district of the city of Ufa, the capital of the Republic of Bashkortostan of Russia. Well, that's one of those places where Russian police uh, working and it's uh, just in a couple of meters from here well also I know that uh, the creators of this place have a plan uh, to place here something like a treadmill and uh, the bicycle simulator and now I can see Irat let me to introduce you Irat well hello hello again how did you come up with an idea to start this club? Uh, we wanted to make a place, a convenient place for everybody, where everybody when uh, come here, he will feel good. Mm -hmm. uh, he will have a lot of facilities here and uh, just uh, come and walk. Mm -hmm. Just uh, build their own future, mm -hmm. own business here uh, with uh, any problem, without any problem. Uh, so uh, this place is, uh, I think, Real good for first of the startups, for the freelancers, right? Yes, uh, designers, startups, marketing uh, services, uh, accounting services, and, mm -hmm. and others. So uh, also people here don't have to care about such a things like a cleaning service, about like a, uh, an accounting. Uh, so they are just uh, pay uh, one, one time fee and, and coming here, right? Yes, of course, because uh, uh, you can come here, uh, just pay mm -hmm. uh, card or cash uh, and uh, choose any place mm -hmm. in this area, in this space uh, and just walk. For Ufa it's uh, kind of unique, kind of new place and uh, I can see that I myself in this place for the second time and I was pretty impressed about this and sometimes maybe uh, I will come here to work to edit the videos of Real Russia too because you know when you're at home uh, all the time something disattracting you because sometimes you just want to lay on a sofa uh, for the extra time or to go to make an extra extra coming to the kitchen to to eat something or maybe to watch something oh, your wife oh. will tell you please clean up the room yes yes <laughs> your... yes really love this place and uh, I uh, really wish success, success to this place, you know? Are you feeling hungry, guys? Yes. Uh, yes. Let's go to the kitchen. Yes, let's take something and uh, maybe uh, go there again to the conference room and we'll continue our talk. Well, everything really looks pretty tasty here. So, I'm looking forward to start. It's a happy day today for our co-workers, so it's for everyone. Yeah. Так, Филадельфию можно замутить. Филадельфия. Васаби. Джинджер. 
Там, кстати, неплохо кормят для уличного места. Да, кстати. То есть, очень... Там еще ресторан снизу. Да, можно сюда. Well, one of the best sci-fi movies ever, believe me, believe me, it's the film directed by Paul Verhoeven. Well, Jerry Goldsmith, composer, music by Jerry Goldsmith, I really love this. I remember when I have seen this movie for the first time when I was just six years old. This is uh, the movie produced in 1990. Where? That woman! Damn it! Amazing movie! Amazing scene! Two weeks! Two weeks! Okay, I ate so much and really feel now very satisfied. Well, I was telling you uh, that uh, here the guys from English club are coming, they are meeting here and now actually we can see that the one of their events uh, happens. Hello guys! Uh, I'm, I'm glad, glad to see you. So I can see they are playing the games. So, uh, who can explain the rules of this game? We have all of these cards. They have various pictures on them. We have to be the fastest person to find the matching picture on each card. And get rid of all of our cards. So, what's your name? My name is Sean. Sean, uh -huh. uh, I can feel that you're a native English speaker, right? <laughs> yes, exactly. Uh -huh. yeah. So, and where are you from? Um, I grew up in the state of New York. So I lived in a small city called Schenectady there. So I didn't actually live in New York City, but anyway, I was in New York State. But now you're in the city of Ufa, in the capital of the Republic of Bashkortostan of Russia. Yeah, exactly, yeah. I love it here. To me, Ufa is a really big city. Cause, Got it. Yeah. So, you know, actually, uh, the viewers, the subscribers of Real Russia Channel, uh, actually all the time asking about Ufa, about how it is for living, for visiting. And I can see you enjoy this, right? Yeah, I am. Um, I don't know. I, I think the city is very, like, friendly to foreigners, at least in my experience. Uh, I think people here are very hospitable. I don't know. I think the, the mix of like cultures, all the students here, it makes for a good city to have like a kind of Russian experience, if you will. I don't know. So you hear guys, so welcome to the city of Ufa. Well, how many times a week you're uh, meeting at such uh, events of English club? Four times. Four times a week. Every week, yes. Got it. Okay guys, that was one of the examples of how different clubs by an interest are meeting here and makes their meetings. Well, uh, keep watching and never forget. Hey guys, never forget to comment, like and subscribe Real Russia Channel. Thank you for watching. And uh, you, you too, guys. Never forget to comment, like, and subscribe. It's easy. See you.